What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, Mr. Pell here today. And today, we are going to be talking about OnlyFans workers and how they think they are content creators, all right? Let's just go through this rule here quick. So a content creator is anyone who shares information, inspiration, humor, experiences, or advice with a larger audience through content, usually digitally. Content creators use a variety of memes to express work. Here are some possible formats. All right, let's take a look, boys. So you have YouTube, duh. Videos or vlogs, blog posts, social media graphics, videos and captions, digital marketing, emails, white papers, music, video game streams, informational ebooks, digital products, and downloads, online courses, and training programs. So you could consider nudity or OnlyFans under visual and audio works. You can say that, right? But let's just work over to a sex worker. A sex worker is a person who works in the sex industry, providing direct sexual services or working in related industries. So you are providing sexual experiences for your people who are buying it from you. So let's take a say this includes prostitutes, pornographic film actors, strippers, nude models, hmm, creators of sexually explicit online content. Wow. I. I think that sounds like OnlyFans. I think they're nude models, or they could be creators of sexually explicit online content. Eh, but you know, it's not for me to decide, just, you know, it's a definition. Then we have phone sex operators, performers in live sex shows, and those who perform erotic dances and act for an audience. So maybe like rock dances, twerking, maybe doing a certain video for someone. That might be considered a sex worker for the person that's paying you, okay? But let's look at prostitute definition. A person in particular, a woman who engages in sexual activity for payment. So by definition, you're already a sex worker. But on top of that, by definition, you're also a prostitute, apparently. So a person who misuses their talents, who sacrifices their self-respect for the sake of personal or financial gain... That sounds like you're getting money from OnlyFans, a.k.a. you're offering someone for sexual activity in exchange for payment. Because I know, and we know, and you know, that you message people on your OnlyFans saying, Hey, do you want to buy this video? And it's you getting fucked, or get fingering yourself, or fucking doing blah, 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 blah. So, by definition, you're a prostitute. By definition, you're guaranteed a sex worker. And yeah, maybe sure you're a content creator. You can say that at the most outside bubble there is. But we go down a little bit deeper. You're a sex worker and you're surely a prostitute. So that is why all OnlyFan girls that sell their bodies for money. Because by definition, if you're doing it for free, you're not a prostitute. If you're selling it for make money, financial gain, you're a prostitute. So get fucked, drop a like down below, or dislike. Let's make it the most controversial video ever of 2024.